The continent's oldest democracies is gearing up for elections, and observers from across the SEDEC region are in Botswana to map the road to next week's poll. Here we have come to observe, and that's our mandate. And uh, uh, we are very happy so far with the security environment which is there. And so we are still to see how it unfolds as the election day comes closer. With election day fast approaching, political parties shared different opinions about the electoral playing field. It is the two parties that have millions and millions and millions. Nobody knows where they get those millions from. What gives them access to the millions that doesn't give the other parties access to those millions? Let me tell you what money does. It gives access to the voter. It influences the voter. It influences the outcome of the elections. We are experienced. We've won uh, 11 consecutive elections now. We are experienced campaigners and our preparations are well on course to deliver a 12th consecutive election victory under President Dr. Masisi with uh, his transformative agenda uh, for the Republic of Botswana, which people are responding very warmly to. The SADC Electoral Observation Mission is expected to issue a preliminary statement two days after the October 23rd elections. Sinkle Inglihihi, SBC News, Khaburoni, Botswana.